Yo, welcome everyone. For the past days, Bitcoin has seen a massive collapse of almost 20%, even below 60,000 US dollars. And the current situation is unfortunately not very good. We are going to notice that we've broken all of our important support levels towards the upside, and not even that, when we are measuring the upper price action with the volume, you are going to notice all of our important volume areas of support, even the value area low right here, a couple of hours ago was unfortunately lost and broken towards the downside. So we are going to notice, okay, Bitcoin is continuing its way towards downside. We are going lower and lower on definitely a significant volume increase. And also, when we are paying attention to the liquidations that are right now coming in the market, you are going to notice approximately 175 million of long positions getting liquidated on this specific push towards downside. And on the one before right here, we have gotten another almost 60 million. So it definitely looks like people at this specific area were holding long or buy positions. They were very, very bullish expecting higher targets, but it looks like right now we are shaking out a lot of money right here. More than 200 million of long positions getting cracked and liquidated on this specific push towards the downside. Now, maybe right now you're wondering if we can go even lower. Remember the video I made a couple of days ago? We talked about this specific five-wave price structure. Now, I don't have the exact five-wave structure right now on this specific chart, but I do think if you compare the push towards the downside with our five waves right here, I would actually say maybe the Bitcoin price even respected our five-wave structure almost exactly. So we are going to notice that because we have gotten a lot of volume in this specific push towards downside, we can right now very, very simply count a five waves towards downside. We can say our first impulse right here, we got a correction. We got another impulse for our third elite wave. We got another correction. And at the moment, it looks like we could potentially finish already our fifth elite wave right here, or we can simply be looking for slightly lower targets for us to actually take our previous low at approximately 59,000 US dollars. Now, let's talk about the exact price targets because in this specific video, I mentioned our one-to-one -one Fibonacci extension level. So what we can do right here, we are first of all actually going to go with Fibonacci extension from the old time home Bitcoin at 74,000 US dollars, putting the second pivot at the bottom right here and putting the third pivot exactly at the top. Now, here you're going to notice we already reached our one-to-one -one Fibonacci extension level at approximately 60,000 US dollars. Now, there comes a very slight problem with this. Yes, I know we have already taken the previous low right here for liquidity, which is very, very nice. And no, we don't have to break also this specific low for us to take the liquidity at 59,000 US dollars, but it would be ideal for Bitcoin to actually go just slightly lower towards downside, take out the liquidity below this specific low right here, and only then do see a reversal towards a brand new all-time high. Why so? Because when we adjust our Fibonacci extension very, very slightly for some kind of an elite wave, we are going to adjust it towards this specific high and not this one right here. So if we do that, you're actually going to notice that one-to-one -one Fibonacci extension is aligning to the exact dollar accuracy with the previous dollar right here at 59,000 US dollars. Now, before we go into the descending channel that is right now also being formed on Bitcoin, if you want to trade with us, you can definitely get some insane free bonuses with the links down below after initial deposit because you do have three very good options ready for you. Now, let me do share with you the exact descending channel Bitcoin is right now respecting on the four hour time frame because we can actually connect our lower highs with a diagonal area of resistance, expand this one towards this specific low, and you're going to notice that Bitcoin is respecting the bottom of the descending channel literally to the exact dollar accuracy. So right now, we simply need to play the probability game. 
we know that our five wave price structure could already right now be finished with the push towards downs that we got a couple of hours ago or we can simply say we can be expecting just slightly lower and then look at the reaction below this specific low right here for us to then actually say okay liquidity taken let's continue towards a brand new all-time high i can almost guarantee you people are feeling scared right here and also most probably they are expecting much lower targets now of course i need to be realistic maybe bitcoin can go lower and we are not going to actually respect our previous low and we are going to see push towards downside straight towards downside towards 50,000 US dollars. But nevertheless, because right now we know, okay, the fifth elite wave, it's actually right now coming towards the end, or it can already be finished right here. And also because we have taken a lot of liquidity below our previous lows, where a lot of people have already gotten liquidated, I would say I would start be looking to go with a very high probability long or a buy position, approximately at this specific area. And also, if you're accumulating Bitcoin and also other altcoins, in my opinion, it's a good idea to buy some altcoins because a lot of them have already gotten an insane push towards the downside now we do know the bitcoin having event it's literally right now coming in two days so a lot of volatility can still be expected and also another very important thing that i do need to point out right here is going to be fibonacci time we talked about already the other day we are going to go on the daily time frame measuring with Fibonacci time this specific part of a correction. So what we are going to do, let's go with Fibonacci time from the high towards the low and putting the third pivot at the all-time high on Bitcoin. If you look like that, we still do have some time towards the one-to-one -to -one Fibonacci level right here towards 2nd of May 2024. So if you look like that, when we know that our first correction, our second elite wave at the moment, still took longer than our fourth elite wave, I would say most probably in terms of Fibonacci time, we are going to chop around this specific area for slightly longer. But I would still say because our very important targets have already been reached right here on Bitcoin, or they are going to be reached in the upcoming hours, because of course, one of the most important ones is going to be our previous low right here at our 1 to 1 Fibonacci extension, I would, as mentioned before, start looking to go with a long query buy and start looking to accumulate as much altcoins as possible. Now, if we start going potentially lower and there is going to be no reaction below our previous low, because remember, we need to be prepared for more upside and also we need to be prepared for more downside. I don't know in which direction we are going to go. I'm only playing the probabilities game, right? So, if we start breaking our one-to-one -one Fibonacci extension, if we go below our previous low right here and see no reaction towards the upside, what is going to be the next very important support level? Unfortunately, it is going to be very, very deep towards downside because you're going to notice we pumped very quickly towards the upside right here. No support levels were actually made. And that is why the weekly support level at 51,770 US dollars right here is going to be the next target if our previous right here it's not going to hold and we are going to see no reactions towards the upside so the best trading idea i do see right now bitcoin at the moment it's simply going to be go slightly lower take out our previous low right here do see a reaction towards the upside and only then go with a brand new long or a buying position on the bitcoin price itself but as mentioned before we can already start looking to build a long or a buying position at the area where we are trading at the moment because a lot of liquidity has already been taken on the bitcoin price itself now if you want get yourself some free trading bonuses after initial deposit with the links down below and thank you for smashing up the like button